Ah, there you are. Welcome to another edition of Dan Factoids. In this case, we're going to be talking about a condition called chronic obstructive pulmonary disease or COPD and diving. Keep watching. We received a question from a prospective diver recently. The diver said, my doctor has recently diagnosed me with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD. Can I still dive with this condition and what are the risks? Well, to answer that, COPD is a condition where the mid-size airways of the lungs are narrowed and the alveolar sacs may be partially destroyed, in which case we call the condition emphysema. It is usually the result of several years of smoking, although there are inherited conditions that may also cause COPD. COPD also overlaps with certain forms of asthma, especially when asthma has gone untreated for many years. The main issues related to diving with COPD really fall into three categories. Firstly, exercise capability. Can an individual who has chronic obstructive pulmonary disease maintain the necessary exercise level that will be required while diving, not only for themselves, but also in the case that they need to help their buddies. Secondly, patients with COPD are more likely to build up higher quantities of carbon dioxide without necessarily being aware of it, and this may even reach the point where they pass out. That is certainly something we would not want to happen underwater. In addition, the increased CO2 actually increases the chances of developing decompression sickness. And thirdly or lastly, there is an increased risk of pulmonary barotrauma as a result of COPD. Because of the obstruction, mucus buildup or blebs, lung overpressure injuries are more likely to result and these may not only collapse the lung which could lead to a tension pneumothorax that could be fatal but they may result in gas embolism where gas is injected into the blood vessels of the lung and distributed to the heart and brain where it could cause disastrous effects. So if I had to summarize this, I would need to say that if someone has been formally diagnosed with the diagnosis of COPD, it is highly unlikely that they would be suitable to dive. We would recommend such individuals to ask their pulmonologists or specialist physicians to discuss the individual situation with a DAN physician or a diving doctor, but the conclusion unfortunately is usually no. So in short, diving with COPD is not recommended. Thank you for watching this edition of DAN Factoids. We hope we've answered some of your questions and we really invite you to continue asking them.